Hey everyone, it's Nicholas Wilton at art to life and I'm working on this painting and um, one thing that I do a lot of is I, um, I'm working on it and specifically, you know, I've carved all these lines into this painting when I was working on it. And I do this a bunch of, bunch of times and I, I'm maybe just saying this because I know sometimes when we do something, we're scared to cover it up. And I think I do like three or four versions of the same thing. But I just want to show you, so, and, and for those of you who follow this vlog, like I've been working on this painting for a little while and you'll probably remember it. I did a, I did a uh, talk about there was a dot in the middle of this thing. Um, and anyway, but I've carved these lines in. You can't really see them right now that well, but I have these lines in here and there's a line going down here and I'm just starting to like re-strengthen these lines. However, um, because I've covered them all up, the second time I do it, I get better at selecting what wants to be in it. So for example, this line, I don't want anymore because I want to like, <clears throat> it's better. I'm, you know, the eye or your eye can kind of move through here. I don't need this, all this tangle in the middle. So I'm eliminating that. And, and now like down here at the bottom, it's, it's almost like there's a hint of what was there before and I can kind of imagine it and how to improve it. So I'm just, you're only going to get better if you do something twice. If you redo it three times, you edit and you improve. And so, for example, so I had this line. See this line? You can barely see it. There's a bit of it. I scored this all the way across the bottom. But now, I can, what I'm going to do is I'm going to take this line right here, so I'm going to just scrape this, and this will show up more when I'm painting, but I'm just going to, I'm, I'm strengthening this line, and I'm going to go down to this point here, and then I'm going to, instead of going that way, I'm, forget about that line, but I'm going to take this line and go over here. I'm going to just this will be better. And then I'm going to connect it to this line. <laughs> and I'm, so I'm basically coming around here, and then I'm skimming along the bottom, then I shoot back up. And I'm not going to use that. You can see it there. That's gone. And there's no way I would be able to come up with this. And there, you know, this is a much nicer, elegant line way better than I would have known how to do in the beginning. I don't even try. I mean, you know, you just, generally speaking, you're going to improve. You're going to get more refined as you go along. So I just thought I'd share that with you because sometimes we think, you know, we go on autopilot, like, okay, I had those lines before. I'm going to go in and fill them all in. But as you go back the second time, the third time, just see how you can, like, maybe it's better without them. Maybe you only do half of them. Maybe you cover that background only 60% on the second time. Your decision makings will improve because you've already been through that forest the first time. So that's just a really cool idea. And I hope that makes you relax because, especially in the beginning, because you, you know, that's the process or that can be a process that you can use to your advantage. And it has to do with letting things go basically. And then, putting them back in the second time, the third time, you just improve. And um, anyway, I hope that helps. That was just something that kind of hit me when I was, I was working here. So hope you're enjoying your Sunday and you get a lot done today, I'm hoping to. Um, if you have friends or you know of anyone who this information could be helpful, um, please uh, forward this along because um, that's kind of how we um, broaden the community and it, it just makes for a bigger, um, a bigger pool to draw from and we all feed off of each other so go ahead and leave a comment below um, and you know it's cool you can even post some pictures of your art I love seeing that and so does everyone else and if you find things and people are starting to do this you know if you think things you know someone uh, sent uh, there was some beautiful writing I forget the gentleman's name but someone shared that link and it was very relevant and it was I never even heard of this poet and um, it's just really cool so if you think think of things that would help this idea or relate, please include it in your comment. Again, have a great Sunday. I'll see you soon.